Hello, today's video is going to be another of my film reviews and today I'll be reviewing Mother's Instinct. Um, I want to show you the picture that I have already drawn, save myself a bit of time and today I'm going to use a mixture of markers but I'm just going to test them over here and see if they're kind of like the right colours. Close enough. <laughs> Uh, so, will do. So, let me tell you about Mother's Instinct. Again, not my usual kind of film, um, and I do have to say it, I did enjoy it. It was directed by Benoit Delhomme, or Delhomme, and written by, let's put this up here so I can see it, Olivier Masset de Pass. I will put these names on the screen so you can see them. Okay, go through. Yeah. Uh, so it was written by Sarah. It was written by Sarah Conrad. Uh, she wrote the screenplay, and it's based on the novel by Barbara Abel. So these two ladies that you can see here, um, they are next door neighbours and they have families. Now, th this is one of the films where if I say too much, I will spoil the surprise for you. So I'm not going to give too much away about the, the story. Other than to say, this is one of the most suspenseful films that I've been to see in quite a while. And just when you think you know what's going to happen, you find out you're wrong. So the film stars uh, Jessica Chastain, who's this lady here. Uh, by the way, the faces are going to look nothing like the real people. You're, if you're watching this and you've watched a few of my others, you know that my these are just quick sketches of the films. And just as a reminder for me, really, of, of what I've been to see. Uh, so, yeah, Jessica Chastain plays a lady called Alice. And Anne Hathaway plays a lady called Celine. Uh, other people who are in it who play their husbands are uh, Anders Danielson Lee and Josh Charles. So, like I said, they are. Where's the lid gone? Huh? They're next door neighbours. They have young boys. And the story. takes you through how the relationship develops between the, the two families and things that happen. It's so hard to talk about this film without giving too much away. Um, and I have to say the acting was really good again. Um, and it started off quite quite light in terms of the film um, and again I'd, I'd looked it up before I went so I didn't know too much about it too too much I like to know a little bit but I don't like to know too much if you know what I mean and um, so yeah I knew some things but I didn't know everything <laughs> and uh, yeah it was one of the best suspense films I've seen in a long time. The, 
costumes again were great and um, Mitchell Travers was responsible for the costumes in this film. Um, the scenery setting was really good as well. Um, I forget what what year, but kind of like 50s, 60s maybe. And uh, again, not to give too, too much away, but it did have kind of Desperate Housewives kind of vibe to it in places and um, kind of a little bit of Stepford Wives in places. Um, but yeah, yeah, really, really enjoyed this film very, very much. Um, and like I say, the, the suspense comes in that you think you know what's going to happen and then what you think is going to happen doesn't. So for this, I'm using markers. I don't often use markers, so um, they're not going through this paper, which is the Moleskine sketchbook. So I'm pleased about that. Um, these are aqua markers and they are dual tipped. So they've got a, a pointy point, fine point on one end and a brush tip on the other end. These were just cheap, these ones. I say this is just a very quick sketch. The music, I haven't mentioned the music yet, have I? And I've not made any notes about who did the music. Well, the music is very fitting for the film. And it has that kind of right degree of suspense and, um, yeah. The film is a 15 in terms of age and it lasts for an hour and 34 minutes. Just point on this one. Um, so yeah, I, I, would, um, I would recommend this film. So I'm going to carry on colouring and what have you with this and uh, I will do something which I know a lot of people don't like which is speed up the the rest of the film. So there we have it, Mother's Instinct, there's the film poster, and there's my drop thing. I don't think I can get them both, both in, but there we go. Just a very fun half hour little sketchy session. Thanks very much for joining me and I will see you for the next film, which will be, I think it's June 2. Um, anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.